what I can do. Buildings. <laughs> Buildings. Uh, lumber mill. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna have an alternate bypass. Crapo going. And it'll just have to do. Okay, cloth conveyors. Run down here. You wanna just work on planks. Okay, we should probably have this be metal conveyor belts. Because all of this feeds into the workshop that makes, well, more. This is what Satisfactory is going to look like. I hope so. I don't think I could have this go any faster. We'd, we'd actually need more lumber going to this lumber mill. I have wildly misjudged some of these things. Oh, time to get it. Time to get another forester. Let's see. I'm gonna do that. I should have enough metal conveyor belts starting to come at this point. Maybe we can just do this. Because, yeah, this is nowhere close to peak capacity. And there's not that much I can do. Okay, now this needs to go a bit faster. Now, the other thing we can do, I'm going to put that there. Uh, let's see. I'm actually going to delete that forester. We're going to move it back a bit. And we're going to build buildings. We're going to make a... Uh, A steam generator. Right there. Okay. And we're going to do t t tools, terrain flattened down. Okay. Didn't freak out on us. Okay, so we want to do paths. Metal conveyor belt. Logistics blocks, splitter. Because this thing doesn't need much. It's got water, and it should get a, just a smidge of fuel constantly. Okay, cool. And we should have enough pipes that we can do uh, steam pipe. Frustratingly... our current demand. Oh, that's fine. Our demand is more than acceptable. Okay. Demand's still looking good. I really wish power plants actually just counted for fuel cuz that'd be kind of that'd be kind of rad Okay, I can get one more of these. There we go. That's about the best I'm going to be able to get. 
It increases my speed for some of these things that does that don't need speed. Because my main problem seemed to be uh, getting enough lumber to them on a given consistent basis. Like, apparently you need, like, buttloads of wood here. I will admit I did not immediately expect that going into into this area. I'm just like, yeah, this will be fine. Chuck some more wood in. The answer is no. Let's see. Can I zoom out so people who have just joined can see the nightmare? I'm so sorry for the bitrate. I haven't gotten particularly tall, with the exception of forge, uh, the Forge Tower, which, like... This is starting to get murky for me. Yeah, have I ever played any of the Anno games? No, they've actually... So I've, I've always kind of wanted to, but they always keep getting really crappy reviews. Which, uh... Which sucks. Because, like, I want to I wanna play Anno, but, like, every time I look, it's just, like, eh, reviews, and I was like... It's disappointing. Okay. So... We need to rethink this a little bit. Because apparently, we don't have enough oomph. We are not generating nearly enough magic crystals. So that is one hell of a backup on one end versus the other. Get rid of that one. One slow conveyor. And a lot of magic. Okay, so we're going to do tools, delete resources, tomatoes, more like, am I right? Okay, what about all of these trees? Kind of like trees. I'll work around them. Tomatoes though, eh. Okay, so we want to build a mine. Okay, you should not make a bit of iron ore. Actually, speaking as such, let's get rid of the... We get rid of the iron ore? Nah. We can keep that there. Maybe. So we do have a bit of... We have a bit of coal. Okay. We can do this. We're going to do structural blocks, wooden arch. This should work. Does that not work? Curse you unnecessarily giant trees! This section's just a little tall. Hmm. Actually, delete that. I'm gonna move it up or s something. So it can actually go up ish. Okay. I kinda wish there were bigger brushes for this. Okay, so we wanna do buildings. Mine. Again. 
That should be good. Okay, this one doesn't just automatically harvest, um... This one doesn't just immediately and automatically harvest. Cool. Perfect. Now... Hmm. What I want is for it to actually be higher up. We might be fine. Do we... I'm gonna move it down a layer real quick. A layer? Two. Cause yeah, we want it we want it to to shoot down a little bit. Be on the same level as the other one. I kinda mess with the timing on it, but like eh. We Okay, got that. Got that. Okay, so next up, we gotta figure out how to get some fuel up in this. Now, actually, it doesn't need to be coal. I'm not even sure if there's much of a difference here. So, I could almost just have it kind of come in at the exact same speed height, whatever. Okay. Forester. Oh, wait, no, no. We can check. What is the, what is the speed of a depleted coal mine? 280. It's four seconds per coal. Uh, two seconds per wood. So wood might actually be the, the preferred fuel source here. Okay. That might not be enough. That should be okay. This one will have to go up. It would be nice if they're all in the exact same level. You know, we could do that. Oh, we could even have the, the fuel roll in faster. Yeah, there's some speed hacks that I could probably do with that someday. We'll do that later, though. Okay, farming, mining. Because, yeah, I can, I can have a bunch of tree planters. Wherever I want. Okay, so we want to do tools, flatten up. And actually, you know what I could do? I might be able to have... I might be able to have the foresters actually be slightly higher. I, I technically probably could have done this with the mines too. Because as long as, as long as they're, they're on a linked resource chain, no problem. Okay. So that should be good. That should be the right 
level? Okay, actually... Should probably be careful here. If I, uh... If I misclick, I delete something in the background. I really don't want that. Okay, so we want to do arches again. Oh. I'm gonna kind of extend that. I don't know why I'm trying to be all nice and organized for this section. I guess it's because it's not part of the spaghetti fortress. So, I don't know. It doesn't feel as necessary. Like, the main base needs to be a, a hideous monstrosity. But the rest of it? Eh, let's keep it a, let's keep it kind of organized so it really looks like kind of this nice feeder system. Did I not bring it down far enough? Damn it. Oh, no, I did. We're good. It auto places ramps for the chutes, just not for the other stuff. All right, so that gets us some logs. Okay. So we want to do buildings. Mana forge. Mana Forge makes Mana Crystals. Mana Crystals. Oops. One of you. Outputting the wrong thing. Nope, actually looks like it's cleared out. Must have just that been that immediate thing. Okay. So how do we do this? Main question is, what's the output? I guess the easy answer is... Hacks it? No. Let's, let's get cool. Kind of frustrating. What I want to do is actually build below. But it's not going to let me. So instead, we're just going to hax it. Let's do scaffolds. So ramp down, ramp down. I do that. Okay. Ramp down, ramp down. And this should be good enough. That's pretty pretty close on point. I guess I can I guess I can actually extend the wooden arch pillars. They actually look pretty nice. For keeping everything kind of supported. Now that's that's not the right spot. This one. Is that good. Yeah, that's good. Okay, there we go. 
That looks nice enough. So yeah, what I can effectively do with this one is, uh... Is just kind of extend it out freely. And have this kind of undercarriage be a uh, mana crystal delivery system. And if I need if I need more factories up in this, then I'm good. Is that one too high? No, it's perfect. Oh, I love it when that happens. Is there any kind of challenge in this? Nope. Entirely just self-motivated. Uh, how do I get shit from point A to point B? I guess the one problem is we're off by by a bit. I guess I'll just have them kind of squiggle over. At the last section. Alright, there we go. But no. No immediate challenge. No immediate danger. Just a matter of... Uh, figuring out the, the right process for everything. Personally, I kind of prefer it this way. Factorio's, like, aliens are kind of annoying. But I guess it does add some level of excitement to things. So I can kind of understand why people would be... would want that kind of business. Oh, dang it. Okay, so that should be a massive uptick in the amount of mana crystals that we put out. It's still pretty slow, though. Which is fine. Because, yeah, what I can do is do... Okay. For starters... Actually... I need to have a unified line down the center. Or maybe not even down the center. Because, yeah, this... This giant wood, like, scaffold system is neat, but I need to offset it better. Uh-oh. How did I do that? I deleted a ramp without actually taking out the, uh... The conveyor on top of it. I've never seen that before. Let's hope I didn't break anything else that way. Okay. But yeah, so let's let's just actually have it uh, spit out from the sides here. Because none of these are going to have a high enough production that they're we're going to run into traffic jams on the way out. Well, we might if I expand this well enough, but that's, that's probably fine. Okay, so we want to do paths, metal conveyor. Delete that. Okay. Paths, metal conveyor again. Okay, there we go. So now that should feed out, and now I can have the whole thing just progressively go down and stuff. 
want to steam the uh the mana crystal production. I could do that. Okay, so we want to do arches. It looks like we've also run into some kind of bottleneck somewhere here. I see the answer seems to be we just straight up don't need more. Because our problem is books, because our problem is what is wrong with you? What do you mean needs mana power? What are you doing? Output storage is full. want to really get rid of all of these. Okay, so why don't we get rid of that? Okay. So it looks like I still need to kill a couple more. Because we need to have just enough that this is spitting... That this is empty. So I'm just gonna delete several of them. Until it has some level of flow. Because, yeah, we, we effectively spammed it, spammed it full. Or, I mean, at this point, we're okay. Because we're just, we're just going to be able to keep that going perpetually. Okay, so we are now uh, over full on mana crystals. So I don't need more for a bit. I'm going to need so many. I just don't know for what yet. So... We've got the books going again. This is the stupidest. I love it. Okay, uh... Let's see, do we... Buildings! Where is it? Steam generator. Buildings! Mine. They called it excessive. I called them very right. Okay, let's do a wooden arch. Okay, so we want to do pipes. Steam pipe. Okay, so that's good. I could hook these whole things together. Now let's do it. There we go. The supply has increased. The demand, not so much so. And I can even hook these things together. Alright, the supply is even higher. The demand is not much. And I've got pipes for days. We can make everything fast. Right, what else have we not hooked in? What's my demand looking like? Well, my research is done. We have the elemental refinery. The stone is looking good. But I might want to get some more uh, power generators here. But this should be fine. So what's, what's this looking like? Uh, let's see. 
So we could do advanced logistics, which probably won't take too long. It gets us a bunch of weird stuff that I, I'm staying away from just because I don't actually know any of these things. Let's do air mastery. Actually, let's do earth mastery. So I have no idea even where to find the air temple yet. Found it. <laughs> Well, that's easier. Let's switch away from this. Air Mastery. Alright, so what do you need? Mana Crystal Air Ether. Produced by the Elemental Refinery. Buildings! Elemental Refinery, what do we need for you? What do you do? What is your thing? What is your purpose? Okay. So we just need Air Ether and Mana Power. Okay. Well, we've got some air stones over here. Here's the question. Can I can I put them down mining? Okay. I can place it, but I got to get air mastery first. Do I see cuz this is all grain over here. The smidge more. Ah, there we go. I just double bought that. Okay. You're the air temple. You need... Christmas. All right. How's how's that going? That is big and fine and this line is stupid. Just get rid of the elemental refinery. We don't need it right now. Oh, oh, that's a that's a long path. All right, there we go. We <laughs> I don't think I need this. <laughs> but I'm doing it anyway. Do I seriously have enough conveyors for this? Damn. That probably just depleted my stock. Where's my, where's my where's my main base? I only have 57 left. I shouldn't do that very often. Still. Oh, and it didn't actually require power. It just requires air ether. Oh, but this. The distillery required the power. Alright, whatever. Or the refinery, not the distillery. What, what am I beering right now? Alright, let's... Do we get rid of the... Wheat? Man, I don't even know. We can probably operate fine without it. Or with it there. Okay. So if I want to make air ether, it is actually just air stones and mana power. Can I have the metal conveyor belts come down? Looks like it can. Looks like it'll do it without complaint. 
Uh, let's see. There we go. And thank you, Deb Stregas, for the uh, 12 month tier 2 resub. One year of great vids and streams. Already cool beans. Yeah. Enjoy that crown until I get rid of it and replace it with something else. The last night in the hotel, Wander. Good to see you survived. It's It's been weird. It's an odd hotel. It's the loudest hotel I think I've ever been in, which is not a good uh, thing. The uh, the person above us apparently has like some kind of clandestine deal with management. But they can just kind of stay here. And they're also a night owl, so they're really loud, which is kind of annoying. Okay. So let's do pipes, mana connector. They're kind of stompy. So what do we do? I'm gonna get rid of that connector and that connector. Oh, we needed we needed one of those. Okay. So how do we do this? It looks like our book situation is still kind of a bit of a problem. I, I could just have another one of these silo. I kind of wish I could actually do blueprints. Yeah, I guess what we could do is straight up just kind of feed the exact same recharge system. Instead of trying to have some kind of weird snaky recharge, I don't even know. Anyway, whoa, damn. Thank you, Deb Stregas, for the 5,000 bits. For luck and fun games to play. Yeah! I mean... <laughs> the, I don't... I, I probably still need your luck, but... Uh, I, my, I, f I feel like my luck has been improving, I hope. The, the house seems nice. I should be able to move in there tomorrow. And so it's... I don't know. Thank, thank you so much. That will go to the TV fund. Let's see. I was actually... I'm probably going to get a, uh, a Vizio... Uh, let's see, a, a Vizio E-Series? I think is the, uh, the exact TV that I'm going to be grabbing. Um, can, I, can I put these on high, actually? Because I, I was considering one of the, the P-Series TVs. Probably like a 65... Or 55, 55-incher. 55 um, but I was considering going with, like, the P-Series, but it was, like, twice as expensive. And the colors were real sharp, but I'm not entirely sure if I need, the, like, that excessive of, of colors. So I'm going with that. Recommend away from Vizio. To be honest, professional recommendation. Really? I, my problem was I was trying to find something with a low input uh, input delay, and that was generally the recommended one, without um, without going to like really expensive territories. Because I can get an okay like a uh, an adequate Vizio for what I need, or like I, I can get an adequate Vizio for. Like four hundred and fifty dollars, as opposed to like one of the Samsung QLED like nonsense beasts, for like three thousand. Let's see. I get an arch here. I can. Perfect.
I have no idea where that ramp went. That should work. You have one that's and it's fine. This game needs smooth, uh, like smoother curves. Okay. Well, anyway, considering this is confusing, and I'm really lazy. Uh, let's do. That's conveyor. So let's put that there. We want to have. Hmm. We need regular mana to pump into this. I guess I should probably move this back by one. Okay, there we go. Now there's the second emote up. You want Factorio curves. Uh, for trains? Yeah. Kinda? The main problem is just, like, they, they kinda hit this curve and they're like, Hurt! and then they go down. Uh, there's no, uh, they don't maintain speed, and I'm like, no. I kinda like it when that happens. Okay, well. Instead of trying to puzzle this out right, or do it right, I, I'm really, really all about the, like, I'm not going to say the quick and dirty, but the, well, just dirty. 